as a company, we need to accept this reality and also uh, need to learn the lesson from this for our future investment activity. What went wrong uh, from our investment decision and that needs to be improved going forward. So that became a very big hallmark for us. For more, let's bring in Bloomberg's executive editor for Asia Technology, Peter Elstrom. Peter, so can we say the war is over for Vision Fund? What drove these losses? Yeah, it was a surprising loss uh, for the company. Uh, the company overall uh, lost just a bit more than $6 billion. Uh, that was driven by a couple of things. Uh, first, the Vision Fund itself lost uh, $1.7 billion, and then they lost some money on foreign exchange, too. That's because the yen has, has been much, much weaker, and they have some dollar-denominated liabilities that they need to pay. The headlines, of course, were about um, – we work in its bankruptcy filing, and then ARM and the IPO. Those are probably the two biggest uh, uh, impacts for uh, the company. The WeWork bankruptcy filing puts a cap on a chapter that was troubling for uh, SoftBank. They came out with the total losses that they've had on WeWork so far. It's just over $14 billion. That was through September. Uh, WeWork filed for bankruptcy just after that, so it's possible that that number is going to increase uh, a fair bit. But of course, Masayoshi Son, the founder of SoftBank, uh, poured billions of dollars into the company uh, founded by Adam Newman. Uh, and now with the company in bankruptcy, that's a black eye for the company. Conversely, uh, they also talked a bit about Arm, the chip designer that went public in the last uh, quarter that gave them a bit of extra cash and now has a publicly traded asset that they think is very promising for the future. The CFO who's taken over um, earnings calls duties from us, uh, he really tried to lean into the positives, right? Is it hard, though, for investors to be uh, overly positive right now? Yeah, Yoshimitsu Goto uh, has been handling the quarterly earnings call uh, for Masa. Uh, Masayoshi Son said he was going to step back because he wanted to focus on ARM IPO. Of course, ARM now has gone public, but he has not returned to the earnings uh, stage, and we don't think that he will. Yeah, there are a couple, a couple of things that Goto called out uh, that he thinks are promising at the company. He mentioned ARM and how that has been beneficial. They raised about $5 billion dollars. In that offering, they still hold uh, about 90 percent of the company. They also uh, said that if you look at it under certain metrics, the Vision Fund made money on its investments. Um, it did. It's a little bit like a company saying that they're profitable on an EBITDA basis. If you don't count the expenses, then they made money on things on uh, the investments category. So that's, that may be a step forward that's slightly better for them. And they do want to start making investments again. They made – uh, $1.5 billion in investments in the last quarter. They've begun to step up after pulling back to uh, a few hundred million dollars of investments in the past. Uh, Masayoshi Son is focused in particular on autonomous technologies, autonomous driving and other kinds of technologies. He thinks that AI, AI and autonomy have a lot of promise for the future for corporations.